call it Gen Z versus Millennial Trivia. There's a hundred dollars on the line. I, we will have different contestants every day uh, this week to win a hundred dollars. Gen Z will try to answer questions that our Millennial contestant for sure knows. Our Millennial will try to answer questions for sure that our Gen Zer will know. Whoever gets the five first is it five first? Um, I have five questions. So okay. yeah, whoever gets the whoever gets the most out of those five, you don't have to you don't have to get to five points. You just have to get the most out of the five. We'll win on one hundred dollars. Good morning, Tiff. How are you this morning? Hey, good morning, y'all. It's a pleasure to be on the show. Wow, well, I'm glad you are. Thank you. It was a pleasure to have you. I've, I've been listening. Actually, I've been listening since I was eleven. So um, it's actually uh, extra pleasure. <laughs> <laughs> and you are how old now? I'm 23. Okay. All right. Well, you've earned $100 because I'm sure we've tested your patience over the years. <laughs> so hold well, on. Like, I've listened to you guys on the way to school, and now I'm listening to y'all on the way to work. I so love it. I appreciate it. I love it, it so much. Thank wow. you for that kind of loyalty. Uh, of let's course. get your contestant on here, and this is Brittany. Hey, Brittany. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Uh, you will be representing um, millennials today. You guys yep. both know how this works, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Tiff, we will be asking you questions that for sure Brittany would know and vice versa. Uh, first one to get to five wins 100 bucks. Well, not the first one Sounds to get to great. five. I got five questions each. So there's 10 points up for grabs. So after we go through all the questions, whoever has the most points wins. Now, um, just a reminder, uh, if like um, Tiffany, if Brittany gets her question wrong, you're going to have an opportunity to answer and steal that point, okay? And when oh, I give you the question to prevent cheating and Googling, you got five seconds to answer. If you don't answer with five seconds, it goes to the other person, okay? Okay. Do either one of you want to confess right now that if we didn't have that time limit, you would for sure cheat? Stop. <laughs> no, 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 no way. No, no, no way. of course Never. not. Never. Never. <laughs> Never. I have millennial siblings. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Brittany, we are going to start with our elders. You will be going first in Gen Z versus millennial. All right, so our millennial Brittany, our first category is gaming. And this is a question that Gen Z should easily get. Are you ready? I'm ready. The game description reads, gather resources, survive the night, and build whatever you can imagine one block at a time. Which popular video game features building and survival elements? Uh, I'll say Minecraft. That is correct. All right. Well done. Nice. Look at you. Nice job. Look at you, old timer. <laughs> 34 <laughs> years old. Oh, jeez. <laughs> All right. Tiff, representing Gen Z, here is yeah. your gaming question that I think most millennials would get. What was the name of the handheld gaming console released by Nintendo in 2004? A PSP? That is incorrect. I'm sorry. Oh, man. All right, Brittany, for the steal, what was the name of the handheld gaming console released by Nintendo in 2004? Was it the Nintendo DS? That is correct. All right. All right. Okay. Well. That's two for Brittany now? Yes, it is. Two for Brittany. <laughs> Tiffany's on the board, but here we go. Tiffany, we're going to start this round with you. Category okay. is social media. Are you ready? Yes. All right. Tiffany representing Gen Z. Which social media platform launched in 2004 was initially limited to Harvard students? Uh, was it Facebook? It is. Yeah, She's go. on the board. Okay. okay. There we go. All right, Brittany, representing millennials, your social media question. What is the name of the social media platform that allows users to share and watch live videos? TikTok? That is incorrect. <laughs> All right, Tiffany, Gen Z for the steal. What is the name of the social media platform that allows users to share and watch live videos? Is it Periscope? It is not. Mm. Oh. The answer we were looking for was Twitch. Ah. Mm -hmm. um, Dang it. All right. Okay. So now we're going to start back with Brittany. Uh, by the way, score is two for millennials, one for Gen Z. All right, Brittany, you're kicking off this round. This category is called vernacular. What does the acronym OOTD stand for? Outfit of the day. Correct. Oh, look at you. Oh, look at you. So hip. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Brit, uh, excuse me. Tiffany, representing Gen Z, category vernacular. What does bay stand for? Mm -hmm. Bay, like, 
like your boyfriend or your significant okay. other, like B A E. B A E, correct. But it, it that also represents it's an acronym. So what does B A E and Bay stand for? Uh, bad. Well, she'll end. I have no clue. Did she curse? <laughs> yeah, did, wait, 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 I don't think I knew it was an acronym either. I don't it know. Is. I, don't know the I use that word every day. I didn't know that. Uh-huh. Yeah, it is an acronym. Okay, for the steel, Brittany, what does B A E N B A Y stand for? Yeah, I didn't know it was an acronym either. Uh, that, <laughs> that's something ever. I don't know. <laughs> that is incorrect. B A E N B A Y stands for before anyone else. I real know. idea. Uh-huh. We all learned something new today. Okay, Not no, yeah. no clue. <laughs> All right, so no points gathered there. Millennials have three. Brittany's got three. Gen Z has one, okay? So our next category is beauty. And this question is for Tiffany from Gen Z. Okay. Love Spell Perfume had a chokehold on young girls in the early 2000s. Where would one go in the mall to purchase Love Spell? Victoria's Secret. That is correct. Okay, you on that. Knew that uh-huh, one. Uh-huh, uh-huh. <laughs> All right, back to our millennial, Brittany, categories beauty. Fenty Beauty, okay, let's let's do our, okay, before we do this, it's the math that makes it so hard. <laughs> All right, millennials have three, Gen Z has two. We have three more points up for grabs. So, Brittany, if you get this point, you win. No, you don't, because oh. Tiffany can tie. Okay. Never mind. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I just had to talk That's okay. That's okay. You got this. I had to, I had to yeah, get there. I'm with you. Okay. All right. Everybody's still in the game. Yes. All right. So here we go, Brittany. Beauty. <laughs> Fenty Beauty is what celebrity brand? Rihanna. That is correct. Okay. All right. Mm. Here we go. Now, in order to stay in the game, <laughs> Tiffany, you got to get this one, okay? Okay. But I think we start with our millennial, Brittany. <laughs> don't we? I don't know where we at yeah, anymore. Okay. We start with you because now we get to go with you. I'm going to need somebody to back me up after a long weekend. <laughs> I cannot do this by myself. All right. Here we go, Brittany, our millennial. You kick this one off. Category is TV. This reboot, set in an affluent neighborhood in Southern California, features Jabari Banks, Adrian Holmes, and Coco Jones. What is the TV show? Uh, um, a reboot. Oh my gosh. Um, I don't know. I'm going to say Fuller House. I know it's not right the Fuller House. Okay. <laughs> For the steal, Tiffany, from Gen Z, and you need this. In order to win. If you don't get it, millennials win. Are you sure, Kristen? I'm positive. Can you repeat 100%. the question? Can you repeat the question? I can least? repeat the question. I'm 99% positive. <laughs> no, I'm positive. This reboot set in an affluent neighborhood in Southern California features Jabari Banks, Adrian Holmes, and Coco Jones. What is the name of the show? Okay, I'm taking a shot in the dark, but since you said neighborhood, is it 90210? No, oh. that is not it. Oh. No. At least you're thinking there, man. Yeah. Yeah. We were looking for a Bel Air. Brittany, the millennial wins! Hey! <laughs> Brittany, you got 100 bucks. Congratulations. Awesome. And Tiff, because you've been listening so so long, uh, we're going to hook you up with like a Bircho t-shirt or something. You got to wear it. Aw, I mean, thank you guys. I appreciate it. You've been so loyal for so long. <laughs> so thank you. Do. Appreciate it. Of course. Thank you guys. Thank you guys for coming on every morning. Do what y'all do. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Gosh, I just want to give her more cash. <laughs> Your business manager would like to disagree with right. you. <laughs> All right, you guys. Hold on one second. We will do it again tomorrow morning. Gen Z versus Millennial Trivia. Two different contestants tomorrow. The Bird Show.